Hi, we are back here again. Okay, now <coughs> to continue on to the chicken masala dish, I've got some spices that I want to let you know. Three cloves of garlic, some cardamom, three pieces, uh, two styani, two cinnamon, some curry leaf, about ten leaves that will do. And I've got some here, it's uh, cumin and fennel. Alright, so this is a very important sequence. you got to follow it as closely as you can so that uh, you'll get the best flavor out of your chicken masala. Alright. So, we're going to add our cinnamon. <coughs> I've got a hot oil here. I'm going to add cinnamon, cardamom, and uh, cloves inside there. Star any cinnamon, cardamom, and cloves. Give it a stir. Okay, let's. Cumin and uh, funnel, some sliced onion. Okay, this sequence is important. Just follow it as closely as you can. That's about three tablespoons of oil, and uh, all this. You just use any cooking oil will do. Don't use uh, um, um, olive oil for this because the olive oil smell will not do very well with this uh, spices. Uh, that will do. Okay. When my onion is a little bit nice and translucent, I want to add in my curry leaf. And I must tell you the smell is fantastic right now. Okay. Now I want to add in my chicken that I earlier prepared. Give it a good stir. Okay, for my chicken masala, I don't use coconut milk, not because I'm health conscious, because the actual recipe does not require coconut milk on this thing. So don't assume all Indian cooking requires coconut milk. That's a big mistake. And anyway, coconut is not unhealthy, it's just that it's not suitable for this particular dish. And I added some water, just washing off my uh, bowl here. And you need to cook the chicken with this. Put it on a low heat and cover it, stir it well. I'm going to put in at this time the drumsticks. A nice color, eh? Okay, potato and carrot are put in later, that cooks faster than the drumstick, so give it another good stir. Make sure everything is uh, well mixed. And we want to just put on the lid. Let this cook at a slow heat for about, uh, say, 25 minutes, 20-25 minutes, uh, you can have a look at the size of the chicken. Uh, once that is done, then we'll put in the rest and stir in. I'll get back to you later. Okay, let's continue with this. I've let that uh, simmer for about 20 minutes. Okay, that looks good. A bit of sauce there and I just want to put in my potato here. Give that a stir. Okay, I must say this at, at, at this time. Um, I'm sorry to disappoint you if this doesn't look like the one you see in the poker center where the chicken will be swimming in a pool of uh, coconut syrup. Um, but anyway, this is how the traditional uh, South Indian cooking that was taught to me by my father. So you should try this and compare if you like this or not. I love this. Once you try this, you probably won't like the Hawker Center stuff. Anyway, that's about it. I will let it reduce until there is uh, no more, uh, not that much sauce or as much as I want sauce. And then um, serve with rice. Beautiful dish. Try it.